All right, so last video, I gave you the basic chords. All right, so I gave you. All right, so now you have your notebook out. I want you to make some slight adjustments. All right, what I gave you was the basic, uh, you know, diatonic chord, uh, you know, chord concept where the one is major, two is minor, three is minor, four is major, five is major. Six is minor, um, seven is diminished, and then the one, or or you back to the eight. Let me give you uh, a little slight change or a slight variation um, that I normally use as it would relate to gospel music. So I play the one major, the two minor, but on the three chord, a lot of times I'll play the one chord over the three. So I'm playing a E is my three, but I'm gonna play a C major chord over the three. All right, that's my, you know, that's my personal alternative on the three. So I don't always play that E minor. A lot of times I'll play that, I'll play that one chord. All right, I'll keep the four the same, the five the same, which would be major, six would be minor, it's the same chord I just gave you, but on the seven, I'll play the five chords. So I'll play a G, because we're in the key of C, I'll play a G major chord over the B, over the seven, okay? So you want to spend some real significant time with that, you know, just 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 getting your ear used to that sound. So just go Let's play it real slow. And this sounds this sounds real basic right now, but I promise you, it's getting ready to get real thick real fast. But once you have this foundational concept, once you know that the one is major, two is minor, you know the three is normal. Uh, you know, according to diatonic theory, is minor. But we play the one chord over the three in gospel music a lot of times. The four is major, five is major, six is minor. The seven, we, we, we do an alternative here where we play the five chord over the seven bass. All right. Once you have that basic foundation, this is going to go a long way because um, I just want to do just some just some quick, uh, you know, uh, instruction as far as how I personally use the the uh, the, the, the number system in every aspect of, of, of what I do in gospel music. A lot of times when I'm learning a song, what I do is I'll diagram or I'll, you know, I'll kind of uh, listen to the song. And what I'll do is is is, is I'll diagram the formula. So what, what, what I look for is where it's going based off the number system. So the number system really is dictated by the bass. You know, where there's a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So once I know where it's going bass wise it's easy for me to have chords because i know that there's only so many options so let's take a song like no weapon you know fred fred, fred hammond song no weapon all right we're not going to play it in the key that it's in we're going to play it in the key of c now i'm sure you heard that song Now, a lot of times, people will play that bass line, it'll go 1, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 1. And that's the pattern they'll use for that song. I hear bass players use that all the time. Well, if I know that, and I'm just using the basic number system, I already have chords to play on that. 
One, seven, six, five, four, three, five, three, four. I mean, I'm sorry, so it's actually two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right? And what I'll do is, once I know the bass line, I put my chords on top of it based off what I already know with the number system. So I just wanted just to give you that little that little example so you, so you can know what we're doing is we're is is we're basically building you a foundation that you'll be able to support everything that you're going to be doing in gospel music on. You are going to pretty much, you know, after you master this number system and know what to play in certain situations, what's going to happen is that you are going to know or at least have an idea of where to go on certain songs because you have a idea of the patterns, all right? So we, we, we have the basic number system. We're getting ready to take it to the next level next.